a chance to get to a final. But first of all, we've always got to keep, keep up with Villarreal. Let's go. What's happening, folks, and welcome to an episode of Rebuilding Barcelona. If you're excited for the episode, hit that like button, help support the channel and the series, and subscribe if you new want to see more from this. Down below is also my links to my FIFA channel and my Let's Play channels as well. Go check those out if you've got time as well. So, today on the page of Karim, I just think this guy's been absolutely fantastic this season. Um, 14 goals, 9 assists. He's fantastic. I'm very, very impressed with him. Now, we're doing one game... Off camera, we're not going to show the goals, only one game. Beat Sevilla 4-0. Surprisingly comfortable uh, is what I would describe this as. Um, we were just I was expecting more from Sevilla, even though they were mid-table. I thought, you know, one-off game, they might show some threats. They had a couple of chances even there, but nothing really significant. 20 shots on goal, 12 on target, 4.86 XG for us. But that's a penalty in there, so that obviously, as you know, would obviously make the XG a lot higher than it is. So league table looks like this. They're basically still um, leaders of Villarreal. They're level on points. That Villarreal game coming up in about four or five games time-ish is really massive for us. Uh, hopefully we can um, get a lead over them before that. I mean, I think they play us and uh, Madrid back to back yeah they do look they play us and Madrid back to back so um, we could potentially uh, that's going to be massive that period there absolutely massive that period there for us so today guys we're going to do games games against Tenerife uh, Levante and Alves now next episode we're going to probably be doing Milan and let's go Madrid uh, after that the reason why I'm not doing Alves and Milan together because this semi-final could go to extra time penalties potentially so I've got to buy, I'm, I'm guided against that um, now the rules just to, just to clarify away goals if scores a level after 90 minutes so we can if we get an away goal they're basically through but of course we don't know that before we start the episode but first of all We've got a league game to get to win, and that's what that's more important right now. It's against Levante, and I'm going to put Ferran Torres in from the start, and Trincao as well, just to give them. To, no, ooh, no, we're not, we're not putting Trincao in. No, I can't take both of them out. I did that before, and it, it, against oh, who was it against? Is it Granada? But it was three 0 and that didn't work. Um, it was really really poor. So one of them out maybe, but not both. So I expect to win. They bounced back really well from the uh, Milan defeat. And look at the four events here currently in. So you just know what's going to happen here, don't you? Um, hopefully not. Hopefully it is a a convincing win for those raining as well. Um, so here we go, folks. Levante away from home in the, in the league. Can we get three points? The form guy would say yes. But FM might say no. Pierre, Manquillo. Pierre, down the side, Dumfries, get across to him. Good football is from the van sailing on goal. We're a chance here. And not a great... I don't do that. Spell day. I hate... The still no downside is tactic. <coughs> Excuse me. Is that... Pay back, pay back to keeper when they could just take it on themselves. Not many highlights again. But we are not conceding many opportunities other than that one this, they, they had. Then freeze. Pass the ball. Clean. Pass the ball. Neves. Good ball. Done freeze. Done needs, needs support here. He's got cream arriving. Cuts inside. Yep. Can you find that pass? Ruben Neves. Pedri. Ferrantos is through on goal. Oh, the form he's in. That's usually a goal. 14 goals he's got this season. I think he's got. That should be in. Half time, really poor. Just not creating anything. Which is bizarre, given that we did, again, we did loads against Sevilla. Um, not acceptable. Get out there. Let's go attacking. Let's try and get this goal. We're, 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 we're not looking like conceding one, really. But... We just seem to be going to this weird phase at the moment where we just seem to be too casual in certain in too many games at the moment. Dumfries on the right hand side. Can he find that ball in the box? He's got Kareem arriving there. Kareem to Ferran Torres and it's a goal in the second half. In this offside, which I don't think he is. One the bats on the one, Levante nil. We des well, I say we deserve it. We needed that, it's more appropriate. Well done Dumfries on the right hand side and uh, Kareem here, no one picks him up. And by the time they realise it, it's too late. Fern Torres, good movement and easy header frame, open net, 1-0, great start second half, that's exactly what I want to see into after the team talk is an instant reaction to it. Fern Torres flicks it on, the bar's trying to get their Fern Torres, Kareem brings it down, finds De Jong, oh that should have been two, it's got to be on target, maybe it should have been a goal as well. 
it's not comfortable. This we and I'm, I'm just worried about us doing, doing. Oh, well done, Pedri. I thought, my, I thought it was going to be red card for a second. Then Ferran Torres in the penalty area. Tell you, we should be free up in this game. We really should. Well, barring a calamity here, which could well happen, we're going to get win by one goal to nil. Trinkau, for the love of all that is holy. Simple, there we go. Full time, Barcelona won Lanter nil. We got lucky with that one. I thought at the end of Trinkau's going to cost us the win there. Uh, not good enough, though. Um, not a good performance. Um, just a bit more composure from De Jong and, and Ferran Torres, and it would have been. It would have been um, a more comfortable result, but we're still keeping level with Villarreal. Hopefully, they drop points at some point, but don't, don't look like it at the moment, does it? Anyway, on out to the cup game. Red Bulls so match number two against Alves Alves in the Copa del Copa del Sul Matadas del Rey, Copa del Rey, I'll call it. Um, we just need to not concede the goal. Through it's the only one to make it basic. And the way goal here would be... Would, uh, we scored one goal here now and this tie is probably over. Um, and we have a cup final to look forward to. And then obviously, I'm not, I'm not sure when that cup final will be scheduled. And I, looked at the, I can't remember when, when it was last year or before when we were in it. Um, so just play what we did in the last game, but be a bit more clinical in front of goal. And they've got a horrible form recently. So we've just got to be more clinical in front of goal. Hopefully we can do that today. We've got a two-goal cushion already in the match, so odds are we should be going through, but we've got to perform. And we haven't been doing that consistently in the last few games, but hope we can do it today. Clock it now for Alves. Dinked in. And they've got one back. Luke de Jong makes it 1-0 to Alves. Alves won Barcelona 0, and that is not a good start. Um, that is not a good start at all, and it's really poor from us. From set piece. I want to see what happens here. No one, there's three guys marking one person. Looking at that, at, instant, at a quick glance, that is really poor. But apart from that one highlight, there's not much happening really, uh, which again is concerning from a point of view of me because long ball the pitch, we don't deal with these. Well, Jong's in again here. And they've scored again. What is it about these long balls? They're just, they're, what is about this team at the moment? They've just stopped playing football. They've stopped. Other than Sevilla, they just don't have a. It's like, long ball again. Just deal with the header. I don't understand why this keeps happening. Jump for the ball. Varand, and then he's thrown goal, and it's 2-0. And we could be going out of the semi-final here, because these guys cannot perform at the minute. I don't know what's happened to them. Throw in now, Dumfries. De Jong. Kareem. Turns and hits one. Oh, good save from the goalkeeper. It's the first real chance of... Oh, say chance. Attempt, I would say, is more a more appropriate word. We've been able to do the corner kick. Kills in the penalty area, and it's been cleared. Kareem, make it yours. Well done. Come on, now get running. De Jong. Thinks it falls to Neves. Here's a shot, and it wasn't, it wasn't really on. But we're just, we're, we're, we're just simply getting bogged down in midfield and chance creation. It's, we're getting more of the ball, but we just seem to just... I don't know. It's creeping in, this really negative performances that we're, we're having. It's really starting to get at the worst point in the season. Just passive. Not looking lively, other than the Sevilla game, which I think Sevilla was bit, pretty poor. But today, we was offered nothing. It's like they're two goal in and they thought it was over. Fatty. Down the left-hand side. That's, again, that sums up right there, that pass. Dumfries. Of course, the goal now means an away goal for us, of course. Dybala. Dum Neves. Good ball. Dumfries on the right-hand side. Needs support in the penalty area. Hasn't really got it yet. Karim. De Jong. Neves. Karim. Open net. Oh, what a finish! If he's on side, that's an incredible finish. Because... I, first of all, thought he would be offside. Second of all, how has he finished this off? I mean, it's a, love, it's a great ball from Neves. It's first time and... Oh, what a finish. And that's an away goal. Which means they've got to score twice now, Alaves. That's a massive goal for us. Maybe get Edgar Sian for Dumfries them, for them because he's got a knock. I don't want him getting injured and that will do for now. There's a highlight going on here as I do make that change. There's going to be a goal from it. Karim. Varane. Pedri, great ball. Crane on the right hand side. He's got De Jong arriving. De Jong in the penalty area. Press it across towards the baller. And he just can't quite get a clean shot on goal. Better in the second half. Much better in the second half. More control. Looking more lively. Garcia's on the, off the bench for uh, Dumfries, who's, got, who's, got, who's carrying a knock. De Jong, De Bala. Better football now from us here. We're playing much better now. We're playing much better now. This is more like it. Fast down the left-hand side. Can we get another one? We get two-way goals. It'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? Pedri. 
Balde hits it. Balde scores. Barca two. Alaves two. And there's the second away goal. They've so they've got to. Yeah, I mean that. I think that's probably done it, hasn't it? Really. Um, that's probably they've got to score. I mean, they've got to score three now, haven't they? To get through because we've got away goals and much better second half from us. We're playing a lot better. Uh, just more lively in in the movement and, and passing and possession. Brilliant. Two two. Can we get? Can we, can we win the game now from two from from two nil down? That'd be fantastic. But the main thing is to get to the final, and it's going to be really out in the final. I'm more than I'm 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 ninety percent certain. Long ball again. What is it about this team at the minute with long balls? I don't know what it is about it. Just just don't win the headers, and again, it's just it's not a hard ball to deal with. Just. Again, it's Ferran out of position. He's not in the right position to cover De Jong. They win, and then they win. I don't think he's They throw on goal, and he finishes it. But long balls, lads. Just what is it about you at the moment? You can't deal with them, can they? Well, we're going through, but this is not acceptable. Um, that these performances are happening too many, too often right now. Uh, just get the ball at the pitch. Just whack it up the pitch. Just get it up the pitch. Don't stand around like this. We're going. I, I hate them do this, by the way, when they when they, when they're under pressure, but. Just they've got to play better than this. We're going to the final. The referee blew up whistle. It's over. De Jong, the referee has blown up. Where's the time come from? Ref, there we go. Full time. Alves three. Barcelona two. But that is unacceptable. For what a bottle? Not accept. No, I don't care if you're demotivated. That is not acceptable. We we can't. They have not won the game in the last five, and we come here and get beaten by them. Luke de Jong was incredible in that game. Um, if I had him in my team, he wouldn't do that at all, would he? But suddenly he's got seven goals all season and three were against us. Jesus. Um, Dumfries injured for two weeks. That's what I thought after I took him off. So yeah, Mortish needed to think, just needed to start gutting the team and just getting people out of the getting people out of the lineup and um, getting them, you know, like Varane and Nianzu, get them out of the team and just resting them. Um, a bit more than we are doing. Pedri's out as well, so Gavi can go back in for him, for example. You know, just really be a bit more harsher with the with the rotation on certain on certain players and to see if that makes a difference. So, right, next episode we've got well, we've got the Milan game, and then we've got the cup. Then we've got the oh, then we've got the cup final there, which against Villarreal. And I can't do back to back. I can't do a Villarreal. I, Cup finals on their own, of course. So we'll come back from Milan. Where are they going to Madrid in the table? But not really, it's not really a massive game, is it, really? Because they're not really title challengers. So I'm thinking we just do... Um, oh, I'm, think, I'm just thinking... One, two, three, four, five, six off camera and then come back for... No, you, you want to see the Milan again, won't you? So Milan Athletic Club will do that next and then we'll come back for the cup final after that. So if you've enjoyed it and I hope you have, hit the like button down below, subscribe if you're new as well. Don't forget to check out the TV channel and the, second, and the Let's Play channels down below. But until next time, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.